All right, you do everything you're supposed to do to take care of your lawn, but they still appear, those brown spots. Dr. Rodney St. John of Ryan Lawn and Tree is here to help. All right, let's talk about that. What, what You can see this, a beautiful lawn right. that you know somebody's taking care of, and then there's that brown spot. What causes that? Well, there could be a lot of things that cause that, and so there's uh, dogs that can cause spots in the yard. Yep, we talked a little bit about that right. before, absolutely. Drought can cause spots in the yard. I've even seen where car exhaust, you know, the tailpipe backed up on the lawn can burn a hole in the yard. People leave their slip and slide out in the yard too long can burn the right. grass as well. So there's a variety of things that can kill the yard. Herbicides can kill the yard, diseases, insects, all kinds of things. And the, and you know, those uh, trampolines you see, I always think about the people who have trampolines in their backyard that underneath that. Right, there's not enough sunlight that could there. Be that. So there's this thing that you hear about this brown patch fungus. What right. is that brown patch fungus? So brown patch fungus is a disease that attacks cool season grasses like tall fescue, perennial okay. ryegrass, Kentucky bluegrass and it starts growing when it gets warm and humid. So the month of May is a good time, you know, when we get nighttime temperatures above 65 degrees and we get humid conditions, the grass is damp, that's a great opportunity for this brown patch fungus to infect and damage those cool season lawns. How do you, so how do you take care, how do you first of all know that it is this fungus and not maybe one of these other items tailpipe. that we talked about? Yeah, a <laughs> tailpipe, tailpipe yeah. disease. Tailpipe <laughs> disease versus, how do you know that it is that? Right, so you, first thing, the disease can start off in circular patches, about eight to 24 inches in diameter, right. and then it can kind of overall just blight the whole yard, just turn the yard brown, but what you really need to do is get down on your hands and knees and look for those lesions on the grass blade. Oh, really? And okay. the grass blade will have these lesions. There'll be a, a bronze copper banding around the outside edge, and it'll have this uh, tan buff colored interior. So you got to get down on your hands and knees and, you know, if you just see brown grass, you got to figure out what's causing that brown grass. So look for those lesions on the blade and really it's something that a professional will help you be able to identify. So how can you, first of all, can you prevent it? And if you didn't prevent it, can you fix it? So absolutely, we have products that we can use to prevent it. And prevention is the key, right. uh, you know, because once we get into June and July, the grass stops growing very, it doesn't grow very fast. Right. So if you get some damage on the blades, it's going to take a long time for that damage to grow up and be mowed off. So you want to prevent it rather than waiting too long um, to get it. But yeah, there's products that can control the fungus, uh, both preventatively and curatively. And the products that, uh, that I typically use are going to be a lot better than the products you can buy at Home Depot or Walmart or big box stores. Right. Those products are good, but they're only going to give you about 10 to 14 days of control where the products that we're going to use are going to be 28 days of control. Is this the kind of thing that if you don't do something about it, it will eventually take over your whole lawn? Yeah, so if, you, if it is growing in your yard, it can definitely take over the whole yard and cause some severe damage. Now the next question would be, is, is everybody going to get it? No, okay, not. wait a minute. Is everybody going to get it? <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> so not everybody's going to get it because the brown patch fungus is in everybody's yard and it's even in the carpet here in this room that the spores are everywhere. No kidding. So it's possible that anybody can get it, but not every yard's going to get it. They might have a different variety of grass. They might have a different climate, more sunlight, more wind, whatever. There's a lot of variability that goes into why some people get the disease and some people don't. That's fascinating. Now you do have a special offer yes. for our viewers. Tell us about that. So it, right now we're one, we wanting to protect people's yards. So 10% off any disease program, any disease application uh, to help save your yard. Wow, that's a pretty good deal. And we're heading into the time of year where, as you say, the lawn care is going to change a little as we get into summer. Right. So this is the time to do this. Absolutely. And next week, that forecast is going to be warm and humid and we're going to see a lot more brown patch. I've seen it last week. We're going to see a lot more next week. Take care of it now. Brown patch fungus prevention is the key. Remember, not all spots equal disease. So take advantage of the 10% off Ryan Lawn and Trees Brown Patch Program by calling 913-381-1505 or visit ryanlawn.com. We're going to have a link on kclive.tv later today.